In this video, I am going to show you how to make an organizational chart in Google Sheets. This is an example of an organizational chart. It is a type of diagram that is usually used to display the hierarchy of an organization. And so it has this vertical layout that allows you to see the hierarchy of various roles within an organization. So most people are not aware of the fact that this kind of chart is actually an option that you can create in Google Sheets. So I'm going to show you how to create this kind of chart. So the most important step with making this kind of chart is to make sure that your data is in the correct format. So what you need is you need two columns. So your first column is going to have the role and then the second column is going to have the role that this person reports to. So you can see here, I have the CEO there at the top of this uh, pyramid and they don't report to anyone. And then I have the level beneath the CEO. So these people report directly to the CEO. And then I have these people who report to the production manager and these two people who report to the marketing manager. So this is the format that you need to create this kind of chart. And so next I'm going to actually create the chart. So it's pretty simple from here. I'm going to highlight my data range. I'm going to leave out the headers and then I'm going to go insert chart or you can go insert chart. So you can either press the button in the toolbar or you can go in the top menu and go insert and chart. And then from here in the chart editor, you want to be in the setup tab. And instead of this chart type, you are going to change it down here to organizational chart. And now I have created this kind of chart. So you can either create it leaving out the header rows like I did, or if you want to leave the header rows in, I'll just show you how that looks. So insert chart, and then we go to organizational chart so the reason I left the headers out is because if you do this um, the header rows are in there now you can remove the header rows if you do create the chart with them you would just have to check this box here use row one as headers and then that will remove that so here's my chart now one other thing we can do uh, with these kinds of charts is you can make it so that when you hover over this position it says the names of these people and so I'll show you how to do that so now I have a new column created to the right um, with the names of each of these positions and now when I create the organizational chart with these names here take a look you can see as I hover over now it displays their names so that may be something you want to do um, next I'll just show you some ways we can edit this kind of chart so if you go to the customize tab here you have options for changing the size of these nodes you can change the node color and you can change the selected node color when you select it. So those are the customization options. And lastly, if you want to download this chart, you can select this three dot menu in the top right corner and then come to download. And from here, you can save it as a PNG, a PDF, or an SVG file. So that is it for this video. If you have any questions, just let me know in the comments. Thank you for watching the video. If you haven't already, make sure to hit the subscribe button. If you have any questions or content suggestions, just let me know in the comments and I'll try my best to answer everyone.